thank you to Vandergraaf for sponsoring this Road to Recovery video. Visit their website to learn how the Grizzly Drive drum motor increases the reliability and reduces the cost of ownership of conveyor systems. David, one thing we're hearing of late, and it's always been an issue that's kind of played the aggregate industry, is, is just some of the issues had with labor and finding people, hiring people, keeping people employed and not going to competitors or leaving the industry entirely. Um, you know, there's some policies at play that are having some effect, as I hear from readers, in terms of, uh, you know, unemployment checks, you know, added bonuses that are kind of disincentivizing people to want to go back to work. I would imagine, you know, as an economist, that's got to have an impact on aggregate demand. Is that fair to say that's the case? And do you have a, a beat on exactly what that means? You know, the labor well, shortage that's going on right now? Good question. And, you know, in business, we have two problems, not enough business or too much business. That's all we have. Now, we're entering into the period of too much business, or what I mean is increased demand. And with it has to come an increase in supply, not only the materials and the equipment, but people. And people have always been a, um, an interesting management problem. And now it's even tougher because we're making it easier for people not to work. Doesn't mean they don't wanna work. It's, it's just a simple matter of incentives. Incentives are very powerful. Um, stay at home for $15 an hour, go to work for $16 an hour, you'll stay home. Stay at home for $10 an hour, go to work for $30 an hour, you'll go to work. So there's, there's nothing personal in that, it's just a trade-off. And true, we're making it a little more difficult for uh, lower hourly wage jobs to get a lot of people. So we have that issue and it looks like it's gonna stay around for a while, we may figure it out by the end of the year. but um, labor supply is just not growing as fast as we thought or we want. There's fewer young people and there's more baby boomers retiring than we would have thought a year ago. So it's, we're, we're starting to enter into a labor crunch and it shows up in job openings. Job openings are at a record, over 8 million job openings unfilled, and it's tough to fill them. That's, that's amazing. You would think people would be excited to grab them right now, but that's not the case. Uh, we'll work it out. We'll work it out. You'll get the labor, but it may be a little more expensive. Thank you to Vandergraaf for sponsoring this Road to Recovery video. Visit their website to learn how the Grizzly Drive drum motor increases the reliability and reduces the cost of ownership of conveyor systems.